Hey, how are you? Good. Yeah, I've been good. Yeah. Okay, so you want your makeup done? Going to a wedding? Oh, that's one whose wedding is it? Cool. Okay. Do you have moisturizer on? Yeah? Okay, good. Okay. So I'm thinking like do you want like a classic look? Yeah, like I'm thinking, you know, color in the crease, like white on the eyelids, some nice bronze, and then maybe like a red lip. What color dress is what color is your dress? Black? Okay. Yeah, I think that would look really good then. You want a red lip? Okay. Okay, let's get started. gonna start by priming your face. Yeah, I love this primer so much. Your skin is like so perfect. How do you do that? <laughs> what do you use? Oh, yeah, I like that brand. I know, sometimes I feel like I do like too much to my skin and then like it just ends up bothering my blemishes and stuff so you just have to like, yeah, like just stop doing everything and then it'll heal on its own. Yeah, I agree with that for sure. Okay. So I'm gonna start with eyeshadow. We'll let like the primer sit in for a bit. Okay, so start with putting like a base color on your eyelids. Yeah, just keep them closed. I always like starting off with like a base color just so the lid is like ready for other colors. <laughs> okay, and then right away I'm gonna go in with this like darker shade and I'm gonna go in your crease. Okay. Beautiful eye shape, oh my god. C close your eyes again. Okay, just want to make sure. It's like really blended right there, because I hate when it's not blended. Yeah. It's just like annoying. It's like my favorite C palette ever. It has all my favorite eyeshadows and then some like bronzers and stuff. I'm gonna use this like darker like maroon color. It's gonna look really good with your eye color. Close your eyes again. I know I like doing like the C slash V shape on. It looks good. I love it already. Close your eyes again. And then, yeah, I just like blending it out a lot so there's no harsh lines or anything. And like, let me know after if you want me to like blend more or like fix anything. eyes are like blurry. There's something in my contact. <laughs> ok, 
Okay. I like that so far. Okay, we're gonna leave the eyes for a second. I wanna like color correct. this um salmon one under your eyes to get rid of some of, oh my gosh to get rid of some of the um darkness so just look up and then let me just i have some on my fingers still so i want to do the other eye yeah keep looking up to blend it in with the beauty blender. I know I love these. I don't know how anyone would do their makeup without one. Like seriously, I know. I want to get like the real ones from um, Sephora, like the actual beauty blender. This is just like, you know, the ones from shoppers or whatever. I've never had like a real one before. No, never. So, I do want to get one. Okay. <clears throat> and I'm going to go back to your eyes. And I'm going to use this like liquid highlighter, like right here. And it's just going to kind of like bring the eyes together. I'm just going to put some on the back of this. Okay. Oops. I know I just dropped some on my finger here, so I'm going to use that. See, like it's so shimmery. I don't know if you could see that, but okay. So I'm just gonna go like in the corner here, and this is gonna like start to dry. So hopefully, it won't move throughout the night. But try not to like touch your eyes or anything. You just gotta get right in here, right in here and then just gonna bring it out more okay oh my gosh that brings out your eyes so much <laughs> love it okay so let's move on to foundation use mac because that's like the best for like going to weddings and stuff because it always looks really good in photos it'll last all night are you gonna dance and stuff? Duh, yeah. I love dancing at weddings. It's like the best part. This is your shade, right? Yeah. You don't need like much foundation at all, so I'm not using that much. I'm just gonna like go in with this beauty blender. That's your favorite part? part. <laughs> That's your favorite part? Foundation? I know, I love seeing like before and afters. Before and after foundation. It's just like such a difference for like a lot of people and it's just so good. It's so good looking. I don't know what I'm saying. just because I end up going over with like color anyway and since we're doing a red lip I'm gonna go over your lips and then your 
forehead. I don't like putting too much on the forehead and then I usually turn it around so it's not too much product. Okay. That's all you need really. Everything is covered beautifully. I'm gonna go like right in with concealer under your eyes. Yeah, so it's just gonna take away that like orange stuff that we put, but it's like your eyes are gonna look super bright and like awake. And this is ColourPop and I really like it. I'm gonna mix it up. <laughs> like a triangle and then the other eye and then some on the bridge of your nose and then blending it out so look up yep perfect it's like a hassle for me so I only really like do a full face when I like really want to because it ends up just being like a chore for me I feel sometimes yeah exactly so I only really do it when I like have to or when I really feel like I want to like um, when I go to concerts and like when I go out and, like fancy restaurants and stuff with friends and like I like doing like a cool look and stuff but if I don't have to or like I just don't feel like it I won't I'll just put like mascara if anything yeah it's just like easier just not doing anything sometimes and like it's way better for the skin when you don't wear like makeup all the time like I was breaking out last week and I stopped wearing makeup to like cover it for like five days and literally my breakouts like all healed and stuff so yeah if you're breaking out just stop wearing makeup and i swear it'll just like heal it i mean it depends the extent of it but okay i really like blending out the under eyes a lot just because i feel like it get really cakey there yeah i know it's weird it's just because i think the skin the, the skin under your eyes is like thinner or something You're good, you're good. I'm gonna powder you up so you're not oily throughout the night. Okay, look up. Add it and then like dust it. It's like a routine. Look up. <laughs> dust, 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 dust. Pat, 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 pat. And then I'm just gonna do layer all over your face really gently. Just make sure it's all even. I want to do for your eyes. Mm, what else do I have here? Let's do your eyebrows actually. Let's have to get the pencil. Okay. Use this pencil. Okay. Do you like going like all out with the brows or just keeping it simple? more dramatic. This pencil is really good. It's one of my favorites. I'm just making like a slight line and then extend 
extending your brow a little bit. And I'm just gonna brush it. Brush it out, brush it out, and then keep going. Just so it looks like your brows, but better, obviously. And I like making little, like, hair looking, uh, hair looking hair strokes. I don't know what I'm saying, but I just like making it look really real in the front. And then brushing it up. a little bit. That's like my favorite part. Extending out the brow to make it longer. It always looks perfect when it's like a little bit longer than usually what it is naturally. I'm gonna do a line underneath and then brush it out a little bit. and then going back. Yeah, you know the routine. <laughs> and let me just brush them more. I like them. They look good. Good. Mm. Okay. Let's do some bronzer slash like contouring or whatever. Use the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. It smells like chocolate. Smell it. I know it smells so good. Okay. Go like this. Yeah. I don't know why I have to do that face. It just helps me like get it on perfectly. some more. I'm gonna do under here a little so look up. Perfect. And then I'm just gonna do the number three on your forehead a little bit. Give you some bronze up there. Okay. The other side do this again. And under here, and then the number three. I'm just gonna do under here. Nice. Looks so good. Mm. Definitely need like some thick mascara. I wanna make your lashes look really big, so I'll do like two layers of this mascara. Do this mascara now. do two layers so it's extra thick. I like squiggling it like this and then going up. Keeping your eyes open just helps like me get it perfectly. Like when someone closes their eyes and does mascara it just doesn't look as good after.
can to let the top like dry a little bit. We'll do the bottom so look up. We're gonna make it like really dark. Okay. Okay. We'll do the top again. So we'll like do an extra layer. do some blush and give you like little rosy cheeks I think that'd be so cute especially because we're doing like a red lip we'll do something like more pinky and I won't do it too harsh so like it's not too like clownish I'm gonna use this see how cute is that color A little bit goes a long way with this stuff. Yeah, seriously. Because, like, putting too much is just not cute. I used to, like, overdo it with the blush, but... Yeah. I know. Kind of, like, on the apples of the cheeks, but also up. And then I go a little bit on the nose. Perfect. Looks so cute. I think like we're pretty much done. Let's just go into the lips now. Okay. You gotta stay really still. Okay, because this is the red liner. Look, this is the color. Yeah, so it's like pinky, reddy, but mostly like red. Go like this. did really good just then like I thought I was gonna have to like redo it okay now go like <sighs> this part's easier because you just go boom 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 <laughs> okay it's good no I don't think so like just And then the lipstick color is like pretty much the exact same. It's a little bit like deeper. Now we're gonna apply. I'll show you what it looks like. Yeah, it's really nice. It's really classy looking. Okay, just go. lips are so smooth, what the hell? I have to exfoliate mine, like, all the time for them to be this smooth. Go like... Good. Do one more time. Good. I'm trying to think if, like do anything else. <clears throat> I think it's good though. Oh my gosh, she looks so good. I'm 
so excited for the pictures. I want to see all the pictures when you take them tonight. Like, Snapchat me, okay? Alright. Text me and have fun and you look great and take a lot, lots of pictures. I'm pretty sure you're, like, good to go. I'm trying to think. Yeah, no, nothing else, eh? You like it? Okay. Okay, bye, girl.